Yeah, what's going on? Alright, so yeah, you know, basically, the the next part, you know, which should be done before, this is something that, um, you know, I did, but I didn't do my curve. Uh, so let's say if the inject, um, what do you call it, the voltage changes and such, then it's going to adjust this dead time. And uh, basically, you know, I was finding, you know, some information, just getting this table. Um, I was doing other calculations too because they don't, they give you, you know, I'm at 50 base, um, but then, you know, like let's say 13 volts and whatever. So then you got to interpolate them. And I'm surprised Excel doesn't have an interpolate function. So you got to do this cool, um, what do you call it, formula where it will, you know, take this, take that, divide it, and, you know, whatever. Then you get it what each step will be. Um, and so, anyhow, I went and uh, did that and got these figures, um, kind of based off these and, you know, confirmed that they were ideal and close um, because there's a lot of information regarding these 2200s. Um, that aren't there so I essentially uh, need to put this curve in my mega squirt so that when you know something changes with the uh, battery voltage that it will adjust correctly and I actually had this issue um, when I changed this uh, wiring on my ECU it, it was Robin Power from the um, mega squirt and it was showing that the car was at, I don't know, maybe 11 volts. And so it was just dumping mad fuel. Um, so anyhow, once I get this, this should help me correct. And that's uh, basically what I do. So I'll go home, do that, and then, you know, it shouldn't change much. Um, but I am going to change this dead time. I dialed it down before I had it. Uh, I forget what I put it to. But now I got, you know, like an ideal one. So I'll set that all up and then probably just have to do a little slight tuning again. No big deal. Just drive around the world. So, alright guys. Wait.